Hello my lovely friends, my name is Tetsi, welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to present to you how to deal with leeches on a large scale. So here we have a selection of leech.com leeches that I received because I deal with leeches every day. So they come with a label, they come with a discount code as well and uh, with some other specifications. So here is the, um, the leech pouches that they send. And each leech pouch is about half a kilo. So that's 500 grams. I'm not sure how many ounces that is, but we will weigh it and we will find out. So let's, uh, let's go ahead and do that. And then I will spread them out into these leech buckets and show you how they live and how you can take care of them on a large scale, like I do. All right, so let's get started. This right here is my scale. And is it gonna get turned on or not? It's not, but we will try with this scale here since I have a backup scale, in case the other one um, refused. So here we are at zero kilograms, you can see. And then with the zero, I put the leeches on the scale and I get 440 grams. So that's pretty much spot on. I need to be around 500 grams. And what I will do next is let me just remove this the leech.com tag. Next, we cut the pouch, just like so. And what I have is a pouch full, and you'll see now what I mean, pouch full of leeches. Look at that goodness. Look at that. And of course, they're trying to latch on to my hands and my fingers as I'm doing this. But I have to keep moving my hands in order for them to not bite. So you see, if I don't do this, they will effectively bite me if I'm not quick and efficient this will be a this will be the end of me <laughs> essentially ah all right so if you're quick your hands will be clean very very swiftly but if you're not quick you might get bitten so i just pulled out this pouch because i had still leeches on it and uh with this tool which is a leech tweezer forcept sorry it's a forcept and it is the plastic variety. But basically what I'm doing is I'm using it to dislodge these leeches from the little pouch. And of course, when you order leeches from leech.com, that's how you'll get them as well is in a pouch like this, uh, in a cotton pouch. And then you will have to dislodge them, put them in their habitat and leeches live in water they also feed only on blood so the only thing you'll have to be worried about is feeding them with somebody's blood either yours or somebody else's and um, most people ask well how do i feed my leeches um, leeches can drink blood from all of the mammals such as you know, like livestock, such as cows, uh, sheep, whatever kind of livestock. It can also drink blood from a dog, from a cat. I'm not saying you should feed your leech with, uh, with the blood from your dog or cat, but if you're in a pinch and you don't know how to feed your leeches, then, uh, you know, then you might want to do a little therapy on your dog or cat. Um, a lot of times dogs will need hematoma treatment, so people will put them on their ears. So 10 leeches 
on the ears of a dog will there's a little bit of dust on my camera um, 10 leashes on the ear of a dog will cure it from hematoma so that's that's how it works a lot of questions I get on that and you see how lively these leashes are that's because they are new stock they're fresh they are extremely extremely um, lively and just vibrant and they get everywhere they're escape artists so leeches will go all over the place if you don't manage them if you don't take care of them so i'm going to do the next one you see one is already trying to bite me two two or three are trying to bite me they were on my foot um Okay, so people often ask, aren't you scared that these leeches will go all over the room and bite you? Well, basically, uh, I'm not scared because I know how to deal with them. I know that if I move my hands swiftly, the leeches will not latch and I will be safe. But if I just, you see how, like if I just stay like this for a moment, that's all they're waiting for. It's just a moment of you know, distraction, and they will go ahead and bite. So this is all they need. Just my distract distraction. My distraction will be my destruction. Maybe about a thousand leeches are enough to kill a person. Uh, that's what my cameraman told me. He's been reading up on that. And, you know, so that's, that's how many bites it will take for someone to to uh, be done away with. So you see, that's how many leeches are in, in those pockets. Let's, uh, let's put the next ones in the next bucket. And I am barehanded, as you can see, because I'm not afraid. You see, they're all over the place now, but um, you just have to move quickly. You just have to be quick and then you will be saved. All right, if you want to try uh, raising leeches as pets, my goodness, they want to get all over my legs here. If you want to try raising leeches as pets, I do recommend it. They're very easy to take care of. All you got to do is just keep them inside water. Jesus, now I got to act fast. <laughs> Just keep them inside water and keep their water changed every couple of weeks or so if it's just a few leeches. But if you have more leeches like me, you got to change the water a little bit more often, just a little bit more frequently. So I would say maybe every day or every other day. So that's how it works with the leeches. And now I go to town collecting them all over the room see that one is all the way over here and uh, of course see they're everywhere come over here to see back here as well see they're everywhere anyway let's uh let me show you how i quickly move leeches as well so if I wanted to take these leeches and move them to another bucket, you see how they went all the way up there? So all I do is just sweep them, sweep them off the sides of the bucket like this, like that. And then they get on my hand and they can be moved. And um, some people, you know, prefer this tool. I, I can either go with it or without it. There is a pregnant one I can show you. This one is pregnant. The reason is, is because she's got a bump. Do you see the bump? It's very easy to, to see that bump. So she's got a cocoon inside her. But she needs a little bit more time to grow and for that uh, bump to get larger and larger. And she, of course, is also very hungry when she's pregnant. So she'll be needing to feed quite frequently. 
Uh, so leeches are Hirudo verbana, this variety. They are blood suckers. Oh my gosh. Oh gosh. Thank you. This one was about to go to town on me. And I don't know if she bit me or not. I don't think so. Thank goodness. I do have leech therapy videos if you want to see how they bite me. So you'll have to watch that. By the way, I have about 200 videos in my channel. So be sure to watch all of them to learn something about this lifestyle. As well as um, I have an Instagram account. It's linked below the video. I also have uh, websites, Tetsi TV, Tetsi.com, and also a Patreon account. So if you guys are interested, head over to the links below this video, uh, find them there, and just follow me everywhere on social media. Get social with me, connect with me. Also soon I'll have a phone number where you can text me and you can find out more about leeches or about anything else. Leeches are a very good pet to, to have. It's a very nice exotic pet. It's uh, easy to take care of. It's pleasant. It doesn't smell. It doesn't uh, make any noise. And it's just a lovely, lovely animal. I highly recommend it. And uh, it is otherwise a parasite. But even though it's a parasite, it um, it's still a very very good sort of like harmless pet if you're a parent and looking for a pet for your child leeches you know as long as they don't put them on their hands and leave them for too long by the way the leeches will not bite on the palms this is a very thick area for them to bite they might bite on the top of the palm but not on the front part same with the feet so they will not bite on the sole of the foot but they will bite on the legs so that's just a little trivia for you i hope you enjoyed this video be sure to subscribe be sure to give me your thumbs up and uh, visit leech.com for your leeches needs and for all the supplies that you will need for either hirudotherapy or just to raise leeches as pets. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up. Be sure to share it with your friends and family. And I'll see you again on the next video. Bye from me for now. Bye. Mwah.